Today, from my grandmother's cookbook, we're going to be making blueberry coffee cake. I've never made this before, so it's a first time for all of us. First, you're going to take half a cup of margarine. I didn't buy margarine, I have butter. Half a cup is one stick. Make sure you get all the paper off. Into that goes a cup and a half of sugar. Beat the margarine and sugar until it's light and fluffy. And while that's working, you're going to put your flour in with baking powder and salt. And as always, we're going to have the recipe at, in the description. Two cups of flour. Two teaspoons of baking powder. A half a teaspoon of salt. Now because this is an old recipe, they say to sift it together. What I just do is take a handy dandy fork and just mix it gently together. It takes two eggs. You're going to add them one egg at a time, beating after each addition until they are blended. The joys of working in a small kitchen is, I think it's kind of crowded. You can use a hand mixer if you'd like. Um, you can do it by hand and it is possible you probably should let the butter or margarine warm up first before you attempt it but it is possible it just takes longer and a little arm muscle to the vault you need a half a cup of milk So what you're going to do is you have to put some flour in the flour mixture and then some milk. Flour mixture and then some milk. And take your time with this. You don't want to just pour it all in. You want to kind of make sure it gets mixed. We're going to do this without flouring the blueberries because it doesn't call for it. The blueberries go on top of the batter. So we're going to try it. I just realized there's no temperature on this. Oh boy. So I'm going to preheat my oven to 350 because that's usually the average temp and then I'm going to keep an eye on it. And it's a workout. I already floured, I greased and floured a 9x13 baking dish. Put the batter in here. So you need two cups of cleaned blueberries and you're going to just sprinkle these on the top that looks like pretty good coverage you're going to get two tablespoons of sugar and you're going to sprinkle that on top of this You 
easy peasy. It is supposed to bake for 55 minutes. So we'll see you back in 55 minutes. Kicks. <laughs> 